to Oakville now where a family is reeling after a coyote jumped into their backyard and killed their dog. Al Sweeney has the details. This little chihuahua named Ollie was a rescue dog that made a place for himself in his family. He's a sweetheart. I mean, uh, like most pets, uh, you know, he was an um, adorable little, little guy. He had a great character, very loyal, very loving. But last Monday morning, Rob Bennyworth let Ollie into the backyard as usual. He was right about here. Wow. He was right about here. And the unthinkable happened. And walked over and it was Ollie. And he was just lying there and he obviously had some bad wounds and was, was gone. Ollie had been killed by a predator. The vet said it was a coyote. Apparently it jumped the fence and killed Ollie before it was scared off leaving Ollie's family devastated. It's a horrible feeling, uh, you know, I think I felt uh, blame uh, as soon as I saw our dog, you know, that I wasn't more protective. It was definitely sad because I didn't get to really say goodbye or anything. Now, Rob and his family are on a mission to let other people know about the risk from coyotes. Our purpose now is to try and raise awareness uh, so this doesn't happen to anybody else. In the park next door, neighbors regularly see coyotes. They usually come up the street and they go in, in, into the park. With the good weather starting, this can be an active time of year for coyotes. The Coyote Watch organization says coyotes are always active, but in the spring they're raising pups, feeding and protecting them. Within the next uh, several weeks, any moms that are pregnant will be, uh, you know, having their their litter, litter of pups at, at this time. They say the important thing is to maintain boundaries between humans and wildlife, like no feeding coyotes. And Ollie's owner is keeping his other dog, Crosby, close, as he says people have to be alert to the threat that can come from coyotes. For those who think their, their, their backyard is a safe haven, um, you know, I think we want to let everybody know that you have to be careful. You really do have to be careful. Al Sweeney, CHCH News, Oakville.